Anybody home? Hello. Hi, how are you? Hey, hey Heather. Thanks Hello. for coming. Hi. This must be Mila. Say hi, Mila. Hey, Mila. Hi, okay. sweetie. It's our nap time. We're going to take a nap, oh, okay? Oh, good timing, Mom. Bye-bye. Let's Bye. see this space. I think you've been victimized by condo clutter. What a beautiful apartment this was. <laughs> and will be again. Don't you worry. Tell me our main focus today. I think it's the clutter, right? Well, this is the main our main space in mm -hmm. our house. So I think your main concern here are the big toys that Mila is starting to amass. Yes. We need some storage that's going to cover those so that you get back this beautiful, classic, contemporary look that you had. Then for Mummy, let's work on a new color palette in here, something fresh and Sounds fun. Sounds great. I don't think we need to paint here because I really love the color. But I think what we could do is accessorize with some linens, some pillows, blankets, accessories. Sure. How would your husband feel about purple? My husband might not go for it. Do you think I could try it and if he hates it, I'll take it all away? Okay, let's surprise him. Okay. taking care of the squeaks, but what's with this wax paper? It's to allow the boards to slide together without catching any debris from the subfloor. Oh, okay. Makes a tighter fit, makes your job easier. Nice and tight. Yep. Oh, that one looks like it's cut to perfection. When I looked at the picture, the first thing that caught me was the walls. I think they're just a little serious for our little girl. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. you could just lighten them up, and, and that would be really pretty. Stay in green or... I like pink. the green. Actually, yeah. I've got a couple of different schemes. The other color that's really hot for this year is purple. So, and I love purple and green together in little girls' rooms. Now, I don't know if you're finding this a little adult, and it might be, but it'll last her down the road, which is nice. And you can also add little girl touches to something like this. Mm -hmm. If you are finding this a little adult, there's also this scheme up here with the little rosebud. There's a toile in there. There's this really nice, pretty light fabric for the sheer. That's beautiful. Oh, yeah. uh, thank you. Oh, did you make that? That's so beautiful. Oh, you are excellent. Here's some artwork <laughs> for her room. <laughs> room. We're going to frame this and we'll give it to Jack? you for free. <laughs> um, but you could go that way. And then a really light color. I'd actually even go with an ivory on the walls. You know, something just really light and airy. That little dresser you have, you could paint that out. You could actually paint one color, paint a dark color, like a dark taupe. Taupe, yeah. And then paint a lighter cream on top and then rub it off on the edges to give it an antique look and go okay. with kind of a shabby chic yeah. feel with any of these fabrics. Right. No, you could do that. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that makes it sound so easy, right? So are you ready? I am. I'm so excited. But where's Heather? I don't know. She's been acting kind of secretive lately. I haven't seen her. Hmm. Hello there. Oh, there you are. Hello. Look oh at me. My. You're looking very Doris Day. I found my antique style. You did too. <laughs> you look great. You know what? While I was at it, I found a little for you. Wow. And a little for you. Oh, great. You got a seersucker suit for me? Oh, you wait till you <laughs> see. Now, you two toddle off because there'll be no reveal until you're appropriately attired. Okay. You All got right. it. Thank you. This is amazing! It's not even the same place! Isn't it fun? It is, it's great. The, it, the whole thing is totally different. You guys gave me a lot to work with from your antique hunt. Good hunting, Renee. Mm -hmm. Yes, I can Wonderful. see the, the porcelain and I can see the lamp mm -hmm. and that beautiful dresser. Yeah, it's those decorative great. pieces are wonderful. And they're also over on that wall in those oh, shelves. They, oh, aren't they fun? Aren't those shelves great? And when you're over there, take a look at that chandelier you picked up. Oh yeah, look at the chandelier! It's, it's wonderful. Yeah. It's perfect there. First thing we did in the room was get these shelves up. The bed is actually going to barricade them slightly, so we wanted to make sure we got them up. We left lots of room for the tall doll houses and stuff that the girls have. Okay, Chanel, three hours till they come. Let's get cracking here. Right. Oh! Hey, these are kind of nice. Look, one for you, one for me. Thank you. I want the Miss Universe. You know what? These will be our safety tiaras. We'll get inspired today. Oh, look at this. It's like a custom day bed. It's perfect. Okay, Chanel, this better be easy to build. We don't have a lot of time to play with. Oh, that's in there tight. What a great safety tip, huh? These things hold everything in there. Anti-topple, so she'll never pull this over on herself. Okay, these are really, really great. So these just go in like this. Look at, they swing back and forth. Once the curtain panel's on, it's gonna not only divide the room into different... <laughs> One second. <laughs> 
into different areas, as I was saying. It'll divide the room into different areas. It'll also make a great little theater.